Hey everyone, how's it going today? Crypto Foxy here. Thanks so much for stopping by the channel. In this video, we are going to have a quick update on Polygon Matic. Uh, price has been up. Things are looking pretty cool on the charts for Polygon at this moment. Uh, are we going to get back towards the dollar? We're going to talk about all that in this video. Make sure you guys smash the like button and subscribe to the channel as well for more cryptocurrency news. Uh, I cover crypto all the time on the channel, and this one is dedicated to Polygon Matic. So Polygon Matic has surged by 24%. This has broke a long-standing downtrend. We've been, uh, you know, trending downwards for quite some time. Uh, this signaled a potential turnaround for the altcoin. This coincides with the upcoming major network update set for September the 4th. So they are transitioning over to the poly, the Polygon token, or the Paul token, P-O-L is the ticker. And um, yeah, so things are just kind of, you know, progressing in that regard because of the update and uh, the overall market sentiment is turning a bit positive. Coinbase has announced the inclusion of the Paul token in its upcoming listings. So, uh, you know, there's a little bit of bullish momentum from that as well. And according to CoinMarketCap data, the 24-hour trading volume jumped 98% to 433 million, indicating a strong investor interest and market confidence in the token. Can Matic hit a dollar amid bullish trends? Well, you know, we're still a little ways away from that. However, I mean, it definitely could. If it breaks through the 55 uh, cent resistance mark, which currently it is sitting at 52.6, uh, aiming for a 65 cent target, this movement might set the stage for a potential climb to a 70 cent mark. I think there's a lot of room for um, Polygon or for Matic to grow here because it has been, um, you know, the, the price has been suppressed for quite a while. We haven't really seen it come back with the rest of the overall market. It has basically just been kind of trickling downwards. So uh, the trading volume has been up 205% to reach 945 million. Open interest in Matic contracts has also seen a significant uptick of 40%, totaling 192.97 million. So that just basically means people are betting on the token price to go up. Uh, so that is good as well. So the four hour um, in the technicals show a bullish momentum. RSI is currently at 89, and that suggests that the asset may be entering the overbought territory. Uh, that is, uh, you know, pretty high for the RSI. Usually, 50 is about uh, 50 is around neutral kind of thing, and once you get up above 50, it's you know it's, very, it's bullish momentum. Obviously, um, we could see a little bit of, of a pullback before we see a continuance on the price rally. But the MACD exhibits a bullish crossover, supporting the current upward trend. Um, we can see here the RSI is. Uh, but this is the MACD here, and this is the RSI here at 89. Um, so downward turn in market trends could see Matic retracing to the 50 cent support level. And uh, if it doesn't hold, we could see a further drop to the 45 cent range. So that's just what you got on the bear side. Jump over, we're going to take a look at Matic on the four hour chart here. That's what we were talking about in the video. So we have a momentum up indicator here. So that's basically, this is this is an indicator I have. Um, I actually uh, work for Austin Hilton and he has this X1 algo indicator. Um, so I, uh, I use this quite frequently, pretty much every day. And uh, it's shown a buy signal back um, this would have been back on uh, the 19th. So that's on the four hour chart. I'm going to take a look at the one day. Hasn't, I don't think it's hit. No, it hasn't hit yet. Um, still has a bit to go for the one day to flip uh, bullish in my opinion. But, um, you know, obviously we'll see what happens. Uh, September 4th is coming up fairly quickly and uh, we'll see. We'll definitely see what happens then. Um, I did do a video about the Polygon um, um change to the Paul token. So Matic is going to be changing to Paul. I did do a video on that and what that entails. Um, I'll probably do another one before the change, has, uh, the change uh, takes effect because I know there's still some people in the dark over that and not, not quite sure what that means. So that'll be for another video. This one's already getting into four minutes. So uh, I'll cut it off here and uh, I'll uh, keep you guys updated. Thanks so much for tuning in. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace.